Hi everyone and welcome back to another ANSIG How To. Today we will be setting up the AP945 UHF antenna. This antenna is made for areas which have good to medium signal reception. The antenna is designed and tested to Australian conditions. It also features a built-in 4G LTE filter to reduce any interference. The box contains one instruction manual, one integrated ballon, one mounting clamp, one twist-on RG6F connector, one weatherproof boot, and one medium area antenna, which is comprised of two antenna booms with braces, one small bar element, one seat, one bracket assembly, 10V element caddies, and two reflector shields. Firstly, to connect your two antenna booms together, lay down the booms with the holes facing in the same direction. Fit one bracket and place a screw in the arrow slot. Fit the remaining bracket on the opposite side and tighten with a wing nut. Now, on the other side, insert the screw into the arrow slot here and tighten with the remaining wing nut like so. Now your two booms are successfully connected as one. Then, assemble the antenna boom via the two bolts and wing nuts, ensuring the upper and lower support brackets seat over the boom squarely. Then, fit seat over the boom here. Next, place the small bar element over the seat, aligning the holes with a Phillips screwdriver. Tighten the screw until the small bar element cannot move. Attach the loop element to the boom here. While ensuring correct orientation, tighten the wing nut until firm. Slide and clasp the V element caddy to an available hole in the boom. Ensure the pin clicks into the hole. The arrow printed on the label will show you the direction the arrows on the caddies need to point to. Repeat until all holes are occupied and all arrows are facing in the correct direction. Slide in each of the reflector elements into the plastic fixture, making sure they face towards the boom. Ensure they're centred and fully inserted. When planning your installation, neighbouring antennas give a good indication of the mounting height, direction, size and polarisation for your location. To cable the antenna, you will need this weatherproof boot and a coaxial cable. Fit this boot onto the cable. We recommend using RG6 cable for best reception. And finally, slide back the weatherproof boot onto the connector. For any further questions or for assistance, visit our website or refer to the contact details at the end of this video. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.